contrast in it, and uh, currently it's upside down on our monitor, but we can make out a fair amount of detail. Okay, we can verify the position uh, the uh, opening I ought to have on the camera. Yeah, what? Okay, Neil, we can see you coming down the ladder now. Okay, Neil, we can see you coming. Okay, I just checked uh, getting back up to that first step. Uh, it's, uh, that doesn't collapse too far, but uh, it's adequate to get back up. Right, we can see you. Pretty good little jump. Buzz, this is Houston, F2, 1160 a second for shadow photography on the sequence camera. Okay. Um, uh, at the foot of the ladder, the Lambert beds are only uh, uh, depressed in the surface about uh, one or two inches, uh, although the surface appears to be uh, very very fine grained as you get close to it. It's almost like a powder. Ground mass uh, is very fine. Now I'm going to step off the lamp now. One small step for man, one giant leap for man. That's the uh, surface is fine and battery. I can with my toe, it does adhere to, in fine layers uh, like uh, powdered charcoal to the, uh, to the sole and sides of my boot. I only go in a uh, small fraction of an inch, maybe an eighth of an inch, but I can see the footprints of my uh, boots and the treads and the fine Sandy particles. Making sure not to lock it on my way out. Hopefully, <laughs> good thought. That's our home for the next couple of hours. We want to take good care of it. Okay, I'm on the top step, and I can look down over the RCU and find the gear pad. be very comfortable and uh, and walking is also very comfortable. You that you're on you've got three more steps and then a long one.
Beautiful view. You got something? Magnificent flight out here. Magnificent desolation. Both PLSS is nominal on consumables. Looks like the uh, secondary strut. Uh, a little thermal effects on it right here, Neil. Yeah, I, I noticed that. That the, seems to be the, the worst, although similar effects are on uh, all around. Uh, Neil, this is Houston. The field of view is okay. We'd like you to aim it a little bit more to the right, over. Okay. Okay, that's all the cable we have. All the way out. I'll start working on the shoulder. Uh, a little bit too much to the right. Can you bring it back left about uh, four or five degrees? Okay, that looks good, Neil. Hey, that looks good, Neil. Okay, now, uh, think that'll be farther away or closer? Can't get too much further away. Let's uh, try it like that for a while. I'll get a couple panoramas with it, here. Uh, Roger, you look okay as far as distance goes, Neil, and we'll line you up again when you finish the panorama. Uh, you're going too fast on the panorama sweep. You're going to have to stop for... I haven't stopped. I haven't set it down yet. That's the first picture in the panorama. Right there. Roger. Uh, Roger. Uh, Roger. 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 Tell me if you got a picture, Houston. Well, you've got a beautiful picture, Neil. Okay, I'm going to move it. Okay, there's another good one. Okay, we've got that one. Houston, Columbia on the right gate, over. Columbia, this is Houston reading you loud and clear, over. Yeah, this is Houston reading. Yeah, radio loud and clear, how's it going? Roger, the EVA is progressing beautifully. Uh, I believe they're setting up the flag now. I guess you're about the only person around that doesn't have TV coverage of the scene. That's alright, I don't mind a bit. How is the quality of the TV? Oh, it's beautiful, Mike, it really is. Oh, geez, that's great. Is the lighting halfway decent? Yes, indeed. They've got the flag up now, and you can see the stars and stripes on the lunar surface. Beautiful, just Okay. 